Hey, 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 what's up, champions? Gedebinas here. Hope you guys are doing well. And today I wanted to talk about being brainwashed. So if you're watching a replay of this, please do me a massive favor and stick hashtag replay into the comments. And if you're brand new, if you're watching one of my videos for the first time, I'd really appreciate if you said new in the comments so that I can say hi to you. I can welcome you to the tribe. So I remember having a business meeting with somebody and they said, are you going to brainwash me? And I said, I sure hope so. So let's think, because I like the word brainwash, but think about what it actually means. So usually people using brainwash in a negative connotation, in a negative way that somebody's being brainwashed, that means somebody's being tricked or being fooled, etc. However, think about the fact that you're probably washing your body every single day. Why do you do that? Why do you wash your body every single day? Well, probably you'd answer that. I want to wash off all the dirt, all the bad stuff, all the pollution of my body, etc. Right? Correct. So think about it. Shouldn't you be washing your brain too? Now, I wish I could open up your head, get some soap and really wash your brain. Right? Well, unfortunately, we can't do that. And actually, your brain is not getting dirty, dirty. Right? But there is some stuff that starts accumulating in your brain. What is that stuff? Well, that stuff is negativity, is self-doubt, is criticism, is all sorts of things, psychological things, mental things that start accumulating in your brain. And that's same as the dirt on your body. Once in a while, you have to wash it off. And how can you do that? How can you brainwash yourself? How can you wash your brain? Well, the way you wash your brain is through personal development. So that's watching videos, listening to audios, reading books, um, attending seminars, spending time with people on the same mission as you. Hey, Marcis, thanks for joining in. Hey, Rena. Right. That's how you brainwash yourself through positive information. Hey, Regina. Right. This is one of the reasons why I personally, I don't listen to news on the radio when I'm driving my car. I don't watch news on the television and I don't read newspapers. I don't remember the last time when I bought a newspaper. Right. Why do I do that? Well, because the news is full of negative information, of pessimism, of all the bad stuff that is happening. So I know if I constantly going to bombard my brain with all of this negative information, it will start accumulating in my brain, right? I will start becoming a negative person. So I want to wash my brain as often as I can. And the way I wash it is by listening what I'm driving to Jim Ron, to Zig Ziglar, to Les Brown, to Eric Worre, to Tony Robbins, to million other people, right? Who are washing my brain off the bad stuff and instead putting the good stuff, right? Hey, Denise. Hey, Dondee. How you guys doing? So my... A mission, if you like, and I promise you, if you watch my videos, I will brainwash you. <laughs> I will brainwash you into believing in yourself. I will brainwash you into reaching your full potential. I will brainwash you into becoming a more positive person. I will brainwash you into uh, going after your soul mission after what you deeply were made for on this earth. That's, I, I, I'm for sure, I'm going to brainwash you. I can promise you that. If you hang around me too long, I will brainwash you like there's no tomorrow. <laughs> and you will be brainwashed. But, but I use that in a positive way. I brainwash myself every single day by positivity, by reading, by learning, by saying even things to myself. I say things to myself. I lie to myself every single day. I lie to myself every single day. And actually, most people do that, but they just do it negatively. They say, well, well, if I speak to this person, they're going to laugh at me. If I do this, I'm going to fail and everybody's going to ridicule me. If I do this, if I take this risk, my life will end and things like that. So they say all of these things negatively. And they put themselves down. They push themselves down. They're lying to themselves. I do the same but opposite way. I say things like 
everything I touch turns to gold. Today is a good day to have a good day. Today is going to be a fantastic day. I'm a money magnet. I attract wealth to me. Everybody I speak to, I leave them better than when I met them. I lie to myself. I say these things to myself. And guess what? I'm starting to believe in it. <laughs> and it's starting to change things around me. It's starting to impact other people around me. It's starting to impact my family. You know, we did a, a, a meeting uh, last Sunday. We did a training event, right? And uh, I came to the, uh, hey, Solis, thanks very much. Um, I came, I came uh, to a training venue. It's a hotel room that we hired. And it was me and my two girls. Now, Greta is 10 years old. Migli is eight years. Guess what? First of all, the whole room, the snacks, the teas and coffees, the biscuits, my girls prepared all of that. Then when people started coming in, the register and the money collection for the room cost, my girls did all of that. And then our distributors, they obviously came with small kids, two-year-old, three-year-old, four-year-old. So guess what? My girls took care of all of those kids outside in the corridor so we didn't have interruptions, we didn't have noise, we didn't have anything. They are eight and ten. But why do they do that? Because they grew up in the business. They grew up business-minded. They were straight away asking, oh, what if we can do that? Would, we, would that raise more money? How can, what if we do this? And what if we do that? Maybe next time we can do this. Except because they're not thinking like ordinary kids. They're not thinking like an employees, like a coin-operated person. They don't think like that anymore. They straight away thinking of all the ways how a business person would think. And why do they do that? Because I've brainwashed them. <laughs> because they spend so much time around me. They spend so much time traveling with me in a car and I'm listening to Ray Higdon and I'm listening to Eric Worre and I'm listening to Les Brown and I'm listening to Jim Rohn that all of that stuff had soaked in to their heads. You understand what I'm saying? So we are getting brainwashed every day, but what you need to ask yourself, who is brainwashing me? Is the politics brainwashing me? Is the news media channels are brainwashing me? Is the negative people in my life brainwashing me? Or am I spending time around positive people who have my best interest in their mind and they're brainwashing me every day? I choose the second option. Hope you got value from this, guys. If you did, feel free to share this. Love you loads. Thanks for jumping on this. See you at the top. Bye for now.